¿Entiendes por qué estoy molesta? Oh, la, 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 la. No estás escuchando mí. Yo decirte eso siempre. No estás escuchando mí. ¿Y cuál es tu problema? Mi problema es estaba vacío para ti para enviarme un mensaje y decirme me voy a ir con Jonathan para desayuno. Vacío. Tú no vas a hacerlo. En la mañana, ¿por qué no levantaste? Dijiste, hombre, no te veo. ¿Dónde estás? ¿Saliste? Mira a cómo estás poniendo culpa en mí otra vez. Cuando es fácilmente para tú decir tu esposa, oye, me voy a ir con Jonathan para desayuno. Porque yo sé, si yo decir, Ali, me voy a desayunar con Jonathan, espera, yo también voy. Pues no, Ali, quiero mi espacio, ¿ok? What? Ok, ok, ok. I'm not talking to you. Wow, qué vacaciones. Por eso prefiero andar solo mejor. Me voy mejor. Oh, my God, bro. No funciona tú conmigo. No tengo tiempo para esta mujer, yo. Necesito mi tarjeta. Necesito mi tarjeta. Don't talk to me. Me voy. I don't, I don't want to talk Necesito to mi tarjeta. Get away from Necesito me. dinero. Get away from me. Necesito Get dinero. Away from me. No Háblame quiero español. hablar contigo. Necesito mi tarjeta. No, déjame en paz. Necesito dinero. Dame dinero. Manuel. Dame dinero. Dame estoy dinero. no hablando contigo. Una contigo y la plena. There's no forgiveness. I know that it was done on purpose. I know Shirai. Hi, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today I'm going to talk about Manuel and Ashley. So let's get into it. So in the new episode, after they end up getting their reading, Ashley ends up walking away because she can't handle what Manuel is saying, and he's completely shutting down. He's just looking at his phone. He doesn't want to hear it, and that irritates me like no other. I cannot stand the fact that he just looks at his phone all day long when they get into an argument, and what bothers me even more is the fact that she's paying for that phone bill on top of that. If I were her, I would have shut down that phone bill, gave him a ticket to Ecuador, and sent him right back. No sé todo sobre las relaciones de Ashley en el pasado, pero creo que alguien la lastimó y, y ahora soy yo quien paga los platos rotos sobre su confianza. Nunca le he dado alguna razón para hacerle pensar a ella que me estoy haciendo algo malo. Manuel may be right. He may have a point that someone may have hurt Ashley in the past, but I believe in women's intuition. And I think that deep in Ashley's core, she knows something's off and she can feel that Manuel is hiding something from her. I'm just, I'm annoyed. This is my friend, Aaron. What's your name, baby? Nice to meet you, honey. You guys are gorgeous. Oh, you as well. Gorgeous. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Ashley. I think what frustrates me the most is like in a relationship, both parties have something that they need to take ownership for. But then it's like, okay. Never hit. Never. Never. Yeah. There's a little bit of gaslighting. Oh, a you lot of it. Manuel makes me feel crazy for not trusting him. But then at the same time, he's purposely leaving out important aspects of his life. So of course that would lead to me not trusting him. This is the definition of gaslighting. I feel really bad for Ashley in this moment because I remember looking at their relationship and thinking to myself, she really needs to take a step back with Manuel because I remember when he was having that conversation with Ashley's mom and his whole body language, his whole demeanor just was so off. Like he had no respect for her own family and he doesn't have respect for Ashley either. And I think he has a plan on sticking with Ashley for a little bit, but then he's going to plan his whole dis disappearance and go off with his friend or go off with his family and leave Ashley high and dry. If you like my videos, please consider subscribing. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. Also, like the video as well and leave a comment down below what you think about Manuel and Ashley's relationship. Thank you. I mean, come on, you cannot do this to me. How do you feel now? I wanted to explain to her the things as they are. 
Pero como le dije a ella y le hice, quise hacer entender a la amiga, una relación no solamente depende de una persona. No puede haber una confianza, no puede haber nada más. ¿Quieres hablar o no? No. 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 ¿Tú no, no entiendes por qué estaba un poquito molesta? ¿Por qué? ¿No entiendes? No entiendo. Yo no sé qué, qué, cómo fue tu vida pasada, pero yo no tengo por qué pagar los platos rotos por ti. ¿Qué? Que me tengas confianza. Eso es lo que yo quiero. Manuel will never admit that he's the cause of an issue. For him, it's about winning or losing. I'm not looking to win. I'm looking to be heard. And that's the and reason why their relationship is the way that it is. But I genuinely think it's because he hardly puts any effort into the relationship. We have seen last season how she pays for absolutely everything. That vacation that they're on, she paid for it. And he has this air of arrogance to him where he owes her nothing, but she owes him everything. She has to work on the relationship. She has to put in the work. And it's so sad to see that because she's not going to get that. I don't think he's ever going to give her the peace that she needs in this marriage. 24 hours later. Manuel left this morning. I was in my sleep. I heard him on the phone, like, D Melo, which is like, talk to me, tell me. And then he was gone. And then I waited like an hour, no text message, no nothing. I call him and he's grabbing breakfast with Jonathan. And I'm just like, just send me a text message. Te let me know what you're doing and where you're going. Because one thing I will say is I am not going to be in an unhealthy relationship, period. I hate to break period. it to Ashley, but her marriage is unhealthy. And it's unhealthy at a very early stage in their marriage, which is a very big concern at this time. Because any time they have an argument, he goes straight to the phone, puts his head down, and ignores her. ¿Estás mejor? ¿O sigues molesta? Todavía estoy molesta, Manuel. No problemas por mí. Toma todo tu tiempo para que estés bien. Porque no quiero gastar mis palabras. Si no vas a aprender a escuchar. Fácil. En la mañana, mi amigo Jonathan me llamó para ir a desayunar. Y ahí le estaba muy cansada. Lo único que hice, dejarle como un lindo esposo, dejarle a la señora que descanse, no molestarle, y salir a desayunar. Pero ella lo toma mal. No sé si que es por parte de inseguridad de ella, no sé. Pero, y realmente no quiero que ella me esté vigilando o controlando en cada momento. The thing about Manuel is that he frames it in a way where he's just trying to do her a favor. He's going out of his way to make sure that he's being a good husband to her. And I'm just thinking in the back of my head, I'm like, well, then why didn't you bring her some breakfast? Who paid for the breakfast? Your friend? Because I'm pretty sure that Ashley paid for the breakfast. You didn't even bother to bring anything to her. You didn't text her. Nothing. ¿Entiendes por qué estoy molesta? Oh, la, 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 la. No estás escuchando mi. Yo decirte eso siempre. No estás escuchando mi. ¿Y cuál es tu problema? Mi problema es estaba vacío para ti para enviarme un mensaje y decirme me voy a ir con Jonathan para desayuno. Vacío. Tú no vas a hacerlo. En la mañana, ¿por qué no levantaste? Dijiste. Hombre, no te veo. ¿Dónde estás? ¿Saliste? Mira a cómo estás poniendo culpa en mí otra vez. Cuando es fácilmente para tú decir tu esposa, oye, me voy a ir con Jonathan para desayuno. Porque yo sé, si yo decir, Ashley, me voy a desayunar con Jonathan, espera, yo también voy. Pues no, Ashley, quiero mi espacio, ¿ok? Ok, ok, ok. I'm not talking to you. Wow, qué vacaciones. Por eso prefiero andar solo mejor. Me voy mejor. No funciona tú conmigo. Oh, 
isn't it insane how this man goes from, well, you should have texted me. You should have asked me, hey, where are you? And then it went from, oh, well, I just didn't want you to come with me. I need my space. No tengo el tiempo para esta mujer, yo. Necesito mi tarjeta. Necesito mi tarjeta. Don't talk to me. Me voy. No, I don't want to talk to you. Necesito mi tarjeta. Get away from me. Necesito dinero. Necesito dinero. No quiero hablar contigo. Necesito mi tarjeta. Déjame en paz. Necesito dinero. Dame dinero. Monroe. Dame dinero. Dame dinero. Estoy no hablando contigo. Una contigo y la plena. Me fui. I feel like he creates problems and then blames them on me. I feel like he like almost sabotaged this so that you can go do what he wants to do. Because like he wanted to be here without me. I mean, that's his wish. Ali is a woman muy diría dramática. No hay que hacer un drama solo por eso. Es algo loco. Che, tu madre. Piensa que el mundo gira alrededor de ella, pero no es eso. Pero si ella se pone en ese plan de dañarnos el día, no es eso. No, 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 no veo lógica estar juntos. Ashley gets it. She's starting to see, oh, wait, he's getting what he wants by arguing with me. Because remember beforehand, in the other season, they would argue. And then they would get intimate with each other and do it. And now that's not even happening. Isn't that crazy? That's not even happening now. What's happening is that he's like, well, okay, maybe I wanted the sex before, but I'm not, I don't want it anymore. Now what I want is for us to argue so that I can now leave go off either to my friend or to my family and be separated from you. This is a sneak peek of what's going to happen for next episode. So let's take a look. Go and start my day crying. Why did that happen? My heart was in pain. You want to understand, learn to understand others. Only you don't exist, Vélez. I called to solve this. You are very big. He's pushing me away. I'm just starting to wonder if he wants to be free of me. Wow, guys, she is finally getting it. I think she is having a breakthrough in understanding that Manuel is being serious when he says, oh, I want to do this, this and that, but I want to do it without you. All of that, that wasn't a joke. That was him being for real like, no, I want to experience these things, but I want to do them without you. Like, I need to be away from you. And their marriage just started. I remember when Ashley's mom was on the tell-all and her mom was upset. I'm telling you, this woman felt horrible for her daughter because this wasn't the marriage that I think she thought she was going to get. And not only that, her mom was giving them money so that he could send back to his family. And I also added this clip that I found from TikTok. It's a girl from Ecuador and she goes to the grocery store and she shows how much she can get for under a hundred dollars. She ends up spending 89 to be exact. And I remember in the past, in the previous season where Manuel had a really hard time with Ashley and argued with her saying that she was selfish, how she wasn't thinking about others. And Ashley had a really hard time because she felt like he couldn't tell her how she could spend her money. And she's justified in feeling that way. I think $100 a month is very nice to send over to a family that she doesn't know that well. That's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching all the way through if you did. 
and please like the video it really does help the channel and please consider subscribing i'm trying to get to 1000 subscribers have a wonderful day bye